Hey there, crafty friends. So yesterday, I played with some paper that I had worked on um, using my sprays. Now I'm just like, where in the world did I put those? Okay, <clears throat> so my new um, Tim Holtz sprays and some embossing folders. So I'll show you those first. Look at that. Va, 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 boom. Look at these leaves. And I used um, the, the, the Spritz sprays. I used some of my mica sprays. I used um, water. I used Distress inks, oxides. I mean, look at this one. It's like the bottom of a pool. Mm -hmm. So anyway, I was having fun playing with all those. And I did this piece of wood, and I wanted it to go behind this jar. And so the jar is really what I want to show you today because it was so much fun. And you could do so many things with it. Okay, so I believe it was Christiane's Crafty Adventures showed, it's been a while back, where she got this holographic sticker film on Amazon. And they have it that is like, can, let's see if you can even see that. Can you? Yeah, I think you can. I hope you can. Anyway, yeah. Okay, so see that iridescence? <clears throat> so you can put it over any kind of paper and suddenly you have holographic paper. <laughs> so I was making this jar and I was like, oh yeah, I want to cover the, the glass part of it with this. So it'll give it a little more freaky look. So all you have to do, you can either just peel this back just peel this back. <laughs> it's not really that hard. I'm technically um, disabled when it comes to this. Okay, so you see how that is. See that? So it's just like sticker paper. So you can just lay it over your stamped image and then cut around it. Or you can stamp on it, then cut it out, then peel it off and put it on. Two ways to do it. All right, so then, so here's one similar, not exactly, but I have already put that on there. So I thought, how fun would it be to make a potion in there and so if I color on this with alcohol ink, like my Copics, oh, scribble, scribble, scribble. So I'm just gonna scribble, 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 bleh, 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 down here at the bottom. Then, and see it kinda went under the edge right there, but I do not care because it's going to be fun. Then I took another color, like a, um, a darker color. That's not really showing up as being darker, but you'll see what happens. i got to make some jagged edges. Okay. So that was really cool, and I liked it. And then the light bulb went off in my head, and I said, what if... I sprayed it with alcohol. Uh, and I did. Now watch. It's bubbling. It's bubbling. Do you see it happening? Oh my goodness. It is so stinking cool. I love it. So over on this one, see I put a large, I actually took out the, the sprayer and dropped a drop here and there. But on this one, I use a tiny spray. But I'm right here, I'm going to put a drop. And you know, you have to be patient. Look at that. Oh my goodness, I absolutely love it. And if you want it to stop, if you're like, Oh my goodness, you're getting too big. Stop it. All you got to do is dab it off. Because it's a little bigger than I wanted it to be. Now, let me see if I can put a smaller dot there, or I could just do that. Nobody would ever know. But isn't that the coolest effect? 
I absolutely love it. And then when you turn it, it look it because the holographic still shows through, it looks like that's underneath it. Isn't that awesome? Oh, I love it. And then I was just coloring some of my critters, so this is some more that go with this stamp set. <laughs> Aren't they fun? And then I had um, this little crew, so I colored some of them and cut them out and, you know, made their eyes with glossy accents so they'd be shiny. But anyway, I think this is amazing. And you could use it for any kind of glass thing. You could use it for, like if you wanted to make a Christmas ornament, if you just cut out a circle, put this over it, colored it, gave it a spray. It would be magical. Also, if you used, uh, say, a pink for the paper underneath, put this on top, went over it with, used red ink, or maybe, maybe even purple ink over it, it would show through in those spaces. You know, you can see the, pa the pink through here. Oh, I just, you know, I've fallen off. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Thank you. I have fallen off the um, the gravy train. <laughs> the gravy train of having fun. Wonder what. Okay, so, you know, how when I get to my wondering, I'm going to put a circle of this here and a circle of it here. Now, this is a, um, a gel pen that I don't, it's not... Um, alcohol I don't think but you know who knows I didn't read the ingredients of it Let's see if that makes anything happen oh yeah something's happening oh yeah something's happening stop I don't oh or do I <laughs> oh so anyway, you just gotta play. You just gotta play and have some fun and and see. So what I might do is just take my pen and give some little dark bubbles around. Oh yeah. Isn't that cool? Oh I love it. So anyway. I hadn't seen anybody else do this. That's not to say they haven't. But I think it is so cool. And I promise you, you will have fun. Now, the, the these papers come in, like I said, from Amazon. In like you can get ones that don't have a pattern that's just holographic, but sheer. There's, I don't know, there's several kinds. And you get um, 50 sheets probably. And... It, you know, it lasts forever. <clears throat> so anyway, there we go. There we go. Double, double toil and trouble. Look. Ah! Oh! <laughs> okay, I hope y'all enjoyed this, guys, and I hope you go have some fun. Love ya. Blessings.